Oh, Christmas tree, oh, Christmas tree, how lovely are your branches. And let's not forget about your decorations, too. Well, it's that time of the year again, as you can tell from my wardrobe, and decoration makers are burning the midnight oil to get their creations ready for Christmas trees. We take a look now at a glass factory in Russia that has been producing traditional handmade baubles for nearly 130 years. <laughs> They're a blast from the past, but these Soviet-themed Christmas decorations are still cherished today. Planes, airships, stars, cosmonauts, hunters, and military men promoted the Soviet way of life in old Russia. Today, they are valuable collector's items, often bought and sold by private collectors. And this collection is at the Yolochka factory on the outskirts of Moscow, which is still making decorations today. Even though it's cold outside, things are really heating up in here as a new generation of workers use glass blowing techniques to create new, unique designs. Balls, pines, bears, as well as conical or star shaped treetops are made by melting the glass with a flame, which is then blown into shape. It's a process that hasn't changed much since this factory was first established in the 19th century. It takes half a year for a newbie to go through training and get the technique down right. Decoration maker Ekaterina Korkina says experience is essential. I think this is work for a designer. We are dressing the tree. We are making an outfit for it. We're dressing it for the New Year celebration. We're making a fairy tale. The process might look simple, but she says that it takes a lot of effort and concentration. It is tough. It is very tough. The work is very tough. When you look at the production and you think that it is that easy, but the blowing out is very tough. Once the differently formed decorations are ready, they are placed on a frame, which is then placed into a high temperature furnace. Decoration factory executive Vladimir Simonovich says there's a long history of traditional glass decorations. The next year our factory will celebrate 130 years of the craft of blowing glass decorations. In 1887, here in this Klinsk district, we opened the first glass factory and from that date we begin our history. After the glass has cooled down from the furnace, more fun awaits. Dins are now ready to be painted. A creative team develops new designs every year, which will then be approved by the experts from the Ministry of Industry and Trade of Russia, a system that has been in place since the Soviet time. Each piece gets hours of attention, as a team of artists will hand paint the glass sculptures with different scenes and patterns, ready for even the most exclusive Christmas tree. Jennifer Shung, CCTV.